Yes, we got it. We got it. We got the transcoding. We're saved. We're saved. We got it. We got it. We're back. Finally. Yeah, we're out. No mittens today. And yeah, one one day, Alok. Maybe one day. <laughs> Let's hopefully by okay by twenty. Whoa, racks. Thank you, Drax. What should we name the baby? Potion. <laughs> it's been nine months. Let's call it Pog Champ. <laughs> Thank you, Rax. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. By the way. By the way. Oh, no! Eh? Eh? Ah, uh, no skateboard, man. No skateboard. We... I may pick up a wrist guard today. I hope I lock, I hope. Yeah, so I don't know, I don't know how these emotes look. <laughs> Tom doubts is, I know, it's like this uh, skeptical Tom face. Skeptical Tom face. What concerns me is when you click on a streamer and you see they have like 6,000, 7,000 followers, but they don't have partner. It's like, oh shit, I don't even have 3,000 yet. Oh, I don't even have, hang on. I don't even have 2,000 yet, hold up. Yeah, it's like, oh. But then you see other partnered streamers with not so many followers, not so many viewers. It's like, how does this work? The emotes look okay, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I needed some feedback on that. So, I also have a tier two emote. That's my tier two emote, but I'm not gonna lie, my tier three emote is a total cop out. <laughs> I probably should change the tier three. The tier three is just like, is just the BT TV Days Vape emote. Uh, it looks okay though, it looks okay. I don't know if my tier two emote is a little dark. I don't know. Maybe it's okay. Yeah, new emotes. Make it solid colors for his tawny fur. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yep, that's, uh, that's some, uh, good, uh, feedback. Yeah, the vape cloud is white. You can kind of see the vape cloud a little bit, I guess, on the white. But, yeah, yeah. I could... Yeah, the vape one's the tier three, but it's it's just the BTTV emote though. You can get it for free with BTTV. Maybe I remove the BTTV one. I don't know. Yeah, the emotes, new emotes. I was I'm so hyped, man. 
I was checking last night before I went, went to bed. They weren't there. It was like, damn it. But now, we got it. Oh yeah, so we're going, obviously we're going to see if I can get some of these uh, char siu bar barbecue buns. Don't get run over. Just shaved my head this morning. <laughs> look at look at the top of his head. Oh, look at the. Oh. Yeah, Mugen, Mugen. I'm I'm not sure. If Mugen is like a factory Honda, like if it's from actually Honda or if it's some aftermarket customization, I got a feeling it might be actually from Honda. <clears throat> should have waited to get it. I didn't know they had it. I should have waited, got a Mugen Odyssey. I think they're probably the top models. If it's, a, if it's actually a Honda thing. Yeah, Mugen's the that emulator, not emulator, but that DIY fighting game. <laughs> Remember when you first discovered Mugen? <laughs> How awesome it was. <laughs> and the insane combos and stuff. Mugen R means without limit, unlimited, or vast. Ah, nice. Commonly placed word power after unlimited power. Oh, is an engine tuner and parts manufacturer that manufactures OEM parts such as body kits and sports exhaust for Honda. Ah, thank you, thank you. So I wonder if they make them actually for Honda I guess maybe it is or just for Honda cars hmm hmm can I get my vehicle Mugen enhanced <laughs> or it's got to come from the factory as Mugen I wonder I wonder oh there's the guy out there again destroying the land R.I.P. Worms. Dope fishy. The mo as stupid as the Mopar, Mugen sounds awesome though. Mopar's like, ah, uh, okay. Yeah, Mo I know Mopar, I know Mopar, <laughs> I know Mopar, oh my god. Dude, in Australia, growing up, all the dudes with like their 70s Chrysler cars, and they all get like the Mopar sticker on the window, big fat tires, loud exhaust, Mopar sticker, that was so common uh, back home in Adelaide. Mo Mohan Mohan Mopar is my love. There you go. There you go. It Mopar seems like very Kona. It's like on 
It's it's like Chev. <laughs> it's like Chevy. Chevy Mopar. That was like the battle, wasn't it? That was the battle. Chevy versus Mopar. Oh yeah, by the way, it's a nice day today, man. I open the door, it's like, oh, just need t-shirt today. <clears throat> oh wow, this there could be uh, paragliders later. Betches, hello, hello. So I've been watching some IRL streams and I'm noticing a lot of people cannot hold the selfie stick or their phone very still at all. It's just like constant like shaking. So I got to really try to try to not do that so much because it's like god damn man hold the camera still dude. <laughs> AJ, hey man, I need to uh, build up this arm strength. I'm known for holding the camera well. Thanks, man. Or bring the gimbal, true, true. It's definitely a great thing for the Yi camera, the gimbal. Yeah, phone and gimbal, I guess with the gimbal it doesn't matter so much, but yeah, phone and gimbal gets starts to weigh a little bit after a while, because the phones are so heavy compared to a Yi camera. I hold my stick well, thank you. Thank you. I think uh, the trick is you got to switch hands. Switch hands regularly. <laughs> regularly. Macquarie, hey dude. New emotes, Macquarie, new emotes. <laughs> yeah, the old switcher hand. Just watch the most interesting YouTube video I've ever seen. Was it the 11,000 IRL marbles game? <gasps> no, no. Oh, you just got a glimpse of it, the ginger kitty. Hold on chat, I'll get back to you in a moment. Let me concentrate on getting this cat. I've never seen a cat here ever. Where is it? Where is it? It's probably... There it is. There it is. There it is. Hello. <laughs> Hello. What am I talking to it like it's a parrot? Hello. Come on. Hello. <laughs> oh, it looks like a boy. Oh, I think I know this cat. I think little birthday cat no oh sorry sorry I think me and little birthday cat know this cat but we don't know its name it's a boy it's a it's a not desexed boy and he's been in huge fights before and but we've got the cutest photo of it oh no that's not it I don't know if that's it this one has a, this one's end of its tail looks a bit too short. Something, hey, jungle cat, where you going? Let's go down there. Let's see if there's any chance that we can say hello to it. Hello, come on, come on, come on, come on. Mama. Glasses with no lens. Come on. Come. Come. Come on. I don't think it's going to come. 
Come on. Come on, kitty cat. No. Hey. Hey. Come on. Bye bye. Oh, did you see it? I think it's a boy. You look like you have a boy face. Look at him go. Oh. You go get him. Oh. Bye bye. Cat, cat. Okay, so he saw the most interesting video he's ever seen. Uh, Andy, on the other hand, he could use a lesson in giving a fuck. I hold my stick well. Build a harness. Yeah, that could work, but man, that's gonna look super dorky. I hold your stick well, oh. <laughs> it was a journey to the end of time. Huh? I don't think I've seen that. What will happen? Yeah. Yeah. That, yeah that'd be an interesting video to see. Oh man, did I get bitten while we were sitting there? Little birthday cat, did you see? Everything dies, it looks like no more light, wow. Yo Linus, we got the emotes, man. No more anything, just darkness, oh jeez. Oh jeez. I guess that's when the simulation ends. God damn it. But you gotta remember it's all it's just theory, right? They don't really know. Question everything. <clears throat> what time is it? 9.48, man. I don't know, we might be too late for the bow. Ooh. The dark energy, yes. <gasps> okay, okay, are you ready? Are you ready? Bruh. Bruh, what are you doing in there? You're someone's pet turtle, what are you doing? Bruh. Please. The expansion is accelerating. Yes, I think I have heard that. I think I have heard that. I was listening to something the other day and like, I don't know if like many scientists now are even questioning the Big Bang. I don't know. It's all, it's all under question, isn't it? Anyway, no one actually knows for sure. Oh man, I got bitten on the elbow. <laughs> Dope fishies accelerating. <laughs> what? This is a flat earth channel, man. We're all flat earthers in here. <laughs> oh God, I love that flat earth stuff. 
Alright, alright. I'm coming back, I'm coming back, I'm coming back. I'm coming back, I'm coming back, I'm coming up, I'm coming up, I'm coming back. My expansion is accelerating, huh? The earth will die in a million years, what? What? We've got to get to Mars. Behind the curve. I seems like I've... Oh! It's on uh, Netflix. I have not watched that yet. I have... Is that the Netflix one? I haven't watched it because I was worried it might be like a, a propaganda video. Like put out by globalists. <laughs> Singular arc time optimal climb trajectory of aircraft in a two dimensional wind field is the equation for flight takeoffs and landings, which is based on flat earth trigonometry. There you go, plant radionics with the knowledge. Yeah, okay, the Netflix one, I'll, I'll have a look at that. I will watch that. <laughs> the the Saikung uh, mega volcano. So, I'm definitely not a flat earther, right? But, the thing that's um, interesting is how a lot... I don't, I don't know about a lot, but some of the things that round earth, global earth, ev like everyone says, on like the curvature and measuring it, some of that shit is not true. So, that's what's interesting. Some of the things they say that prove it is a, glo is a globe, is they're not right. That's the thing, some, some. That's the one thing that's kind of interesting. <laughs> it's fun. Linus Van Kitty. I can't just now that's science. That's science though. See, there you go. That proves it is is a globe. They've seen the curvature of the Oh yeah, I know a I know a SR71 pilot. Let me just call him up. <laughs> But yeah, 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 I, I, I get it, I get it. It's, even if you don't know anything about science, just that all the pl other planets and shit are around, you know, why would this be different, you know? It doesn't make any sense, just that alone. Because it's not like flat earthers think every planet's flat. They think everything else is round, or a globe. But only the earth is flat. It's like, hey, how hold up. I was I was watching a, a a flat earther, some some British dude or Irish dude, I think he's quite popular in that community, do a live stream on YouTube. And I asked him a question. <laughs> I asked him where where do meteorites and shit come from? And he didn't he couldn't answer it, he didn't know. He said, oh, we don't, we haven't worked that out yet. And it's like, okay. 
Uh huh. Space is fake. Yep, yep. That's also the deal, isn't it? Yeah, I don't even know what an SR seventy one is. But yeah, I do. Uh, I do know some like uh, jumbo jet pilots, and but I've wanted to ask them if they've seen any UFOs, <laughs> but I haven't. So I, I'm probably not going to ask them about the flat Earth. <laughs> Uh, it's, oh, it's a high altitude plane on the edge of space. Uh, it's just, I don't know, I don't, I'm not offended by Flat Earth and that. Uh, I just find their, some of their videos, like their popular videos, they're kind of interesting, you know, for someone who knows zero about science, you know. They're kind of interesting. But yeah, not saying I believe it. But it's it's a nice it's a the mystery. It's nice to fantasize about, especially the uh, the Arctic Wall or whatever the ice wall. Yeah, it's, it's it's it is interesting, man. It's nice to fantasize. Yeah, yeah, I don't know science, right, right. And I have, I don't know if it's out, but I have not watched the Lo Logan Paul, Logan Paul's new Flat Earth video. I have not seen that. I don't know if I will watch that, probably not. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> and, but you know, they all, they always say about that guy is, I think it's Admiral Bird, some guy that apparently flew past the Antarctic or something. I, I don't know. I haven't really watched it uh, too in depth, but yeah, some old army or air force guy says he flew past the, found new land. I don't know. I flew from NA over the North, North Pole, past Russia, Japan to Hong Kong. Wow. Wow. I had no idea. There are many abductions on board UFOs and secret military bases that are conducted, not by aliens, but from our own time but by us in the future. I refer to these times as chrononauts. They originate between 1,000 and 3,000 years from our future. What? AJV Games, what are you, what are you going on about? <laughs> Flat Earthers believe the North Pole is the center of the Earth disk. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Uh, oh man, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I just remember watching the video. There's like some video, the, the main guy, Eric Dupe, his popular flat Earth video. I remember watching it and being like, oh. <laughs> Oh, Servo! Servo went there! Servo went there! <laughs> the hollow moon? I don't know about the hollow moon, but I've heard about the holographic moon, or that the moon actually has its own light source. I've heard that. But one thing I, I've heard, I think Neil deGrasse Tyson on Rogan was saying how that there, a planet may not necessarily need a sun to, to like exist and possibly have life, that the heat from the planet itself, like I think that's a thing 
they've uh, maybe they in theory they think they exist planets without suns whoa servo servo five gift subs oh, hey dude thank you servo five gift is that oh no that's a gift sub that i thought you just gave five five in total thank you thank you linus congratulations I was about to crap myself. Thank you, dude. Thank you, thank you, Servo. Uh, Linus Van Kitty, welcome to the corn crew. Shorty Sammy, what's your opinion? Does Shorty Sammy live on a flat earth? The Earth is shaped like an M. The Moon is a space station. Um, rotating. Is the Earth rotating? Um. There's something of the flat Earthers. There's something they say about the positioning of the stars. They do go on about something about that, about the North Star. Apparently, I don't know. The crystal transparent buildings on the moon. Yep, yeah, I seen those photos. Dope, just just let it be known. Dope fishy does not believe in flat Earth. Hey, whoa guy, hey man. Right, right, the, yeah, the vents, the volcanic vents in the ocean, uh-huh, uh-huh, they sustain life. Right, right. That's right. New emotes, mine quad, we got them, we got them. Cat emotes, dude. Loki Mitter? I don't. I have not seen that one. Ah, uh, so I think they say the sun. Possibly, do they say the sun goes in a figure eight <laughs> above the? Uh, it, it goes. From a higher rotation or to a low rotation, or is it a figure eight? But it, it varies in height, I think they say. And but they also believe the sun is something like three thousand miles away, seven thousand miles away. I think that's another thing, which seems like uh that's a, that's kind of weird. I don't know about that. <laughs> it was named after a man living on Saturn in the future. <laughs> um, so, how come I saw you in a Philippine stream? What? What? Chicago Ninja's a homie, man. Chicago Ninja's my homie. I was dropping in, saying him, saying hey, giving him some shit. And then I left. <laughs> Someone threw a giant blanket over the entire. St oh, <laughs> over the ent I thought I saw someone threw a blanket over the statue of Massachusetts, the state. Yeah, we got a Tom Tom emote and a mitten emote. Uh, I'll Google it later, man. Later. But I, re I will remember the name. Yeah, yeah. 
the light from the sun is from eight minutes ago. No, so they believe everything else is round or globular. Only the Earth is flat, which is fucking weird. Why isn't Mars flat? Am I your? I don't. I don't. I only seen you one time before, man. I only seen you, and you don't want to get your cat de sex, so I don't know if you're a homie. <laughs> Yeah, no vaccines, yep. So I was listening to something yesterday and they was, you know how there's like these Russian troll farms they've discovered that spread a lot of the start, a lot of this bullshit? I heard that no vaccines thing may have been started in the Russian troll farms or perpetuated by the Russian troll farms. <laughs> what the fuck I thought you I just met you I just met you man I just met you but you are right you are right <laughs> uh, vaccines have always been in question yeah yeah Jim Carrey yes I I know he's been talking some crazy stuff Goes back to the 80s in the US. Dude. I think we need to desex some uh, humans. <laughs> actually, dude, actually, it's not that bad. Whoa, guy. People get that same procedure every day. Men get that same procedure every day, dude. So it's not a problem. Unless if after you get a vasectomy, you turn into a soy boy and then you might have a soy cat. Yeah, yeah, you don't want to end up with small box. <laughs> Small box, not something you would uh, enjoy. I've heard it's painful. Man, why did I go this way? This is no way near the bow. I'm on a spin sent on a wild goose chase. God damn it. Fire guy, hey dude. It's not castration. Is it? Oh, wait, 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 wait. So, they definitely, is castration removing, okay, let's get medical. Medical, we're getting medical right here. This is serious talk. Castration, is that the removal of the testes? Is that what that is? Because after you get your male cat de-sexed, it still has those. It's still, it's testes are still there. So, so, so the cats, everything's still there, right? I don't know if it was different in the past, but the cat, everything's still there, you know? It still has its balls, you know? They just shrink over time. So I, I don't know, I don't know what the correct term is.
No, they don't. They don't do. <laughs> my mittens, all my cats, after they got these sacks, they all had their balls. Nah, man, they're bo dude. I don't. I, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. I'm not gonna say I'm a hundred percent right, but. My cats, after the, they were desexed, they had their balls still. Maybe I need to research that. I don't want to, yeah, I don't want to say I'm uh, absolutely right, but I, I think I'm right. But uh, there, there's definitely chance that I'm wrong. I will accept that. Yeah, Woga, yes, yes, yes. So, from observation, just pure observation, after you get a, your cat desexed, it still has its testicles, right? Observation. But after, over the next six months or something, they will shrink and shrink to like tiny. That's observation. I don't know if that's medically what happens, but just observation is, that's what it seems like. That's why I say what I say. <laughs> Do I measure them? <laughs> oh no, they're 100% they're desex, man. Yeah, I mean, I need to look up what the actual medical procedure is. But yeah, it appears they still have their balls afterwards. But over time, they shrink down to like nothing. Wow, man, that's that's so strange, Robert Ducks. That's really strange. Now I'm actually really curious now what the deal is there. How do I know the D sex is working? Because they're not going insane to get outside all the time. Because once you have a male cat that can sense there's a female cat in heat, they go absolutely crazy. And you know, afterwards, you know, they're fine. And they, they do not, sp they've never sprayed inside also. I don't know if they were, if they were not desexed, if they'd spray inside, I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look that up. I'm gonna look that up, because now I'm actually, I'm curious. <laughs> birthday cat sorry sorry ladies sorry ladies but yeah that, that's it I'm definitely curious about that now because I'd like to know you know uh, how exactly that works Have we got any vets in here? Hang on. Do we have any vets in here? <laughs> There's going to be a YouTube video, most likely.
So, when the male cats got desexed, I think, as far as I know, they don't need any any uh, real bandage or a collar. They don't need that. The one when I got mine done, but the female cat, they had to wear a collar afterwards. But the male cats, they were they were okay. I don't, mm, I don't know if the procedure may have changed recently or you know in more modern time. I don't know. I don't know. Ah, uh, yeah, we lagged for a second when I switched the camera and it locked up. Yeah, you got to think about the all the kittens, all the kittens. And yeah, puppies that will be unwanted and may have to get put down. Oh my God, it's Cujo. It's freaking Cujo. Look at, look at that good boy. Look at good boy. <laughs> Dude, don't worry. Whoa, guy, don't worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about the cat. <laughs> don't worry, man. I think you're not ready to have a cat at this moment in time. <laughs> so, uh, my first... So, we had a girl cat. The first cat we had was a girl cat. She got... We didn't have her desex. She got pregnant. Had four kittens, right? Four boys. And I didn't get them desexed for at least the first year. In that time, one of them ran away. Uh, and the others were going absolutely crazy to get outside at nighttime. It was so, it was so much drama. That says like, we really had no choice but to get them desexed. Like, it will drive you mad. All right, let's get these bow. Let's get these bowl. I mean, bows. Yeah, now the entire jungle is full of Miu Miu's descendants. Uh, oh man, what time is it? 10.09, I don't know if they're gonna have any guys. Let's see what we can do. Two. Let me get one of these for later.
Thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got it. We got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got bows and bows. Let's go sit down in the usual spot. Right about here. Oh. Yeah, we got the barbecue pork buns. We got two, we got two. Pineapple, uh, bolo bao. They're good, they're good. Uh, I rarely get them though, but yeah, they're good. Hey, they're one of the most popular buns for sure. Definitely one of the most popular. Hot, 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 hot. Shove it all in my mouth, are you crazy? <laughs> Random stuff, yeah. New kitty emotes. could see the steam coming off them. Thought I was Muslim. Because of my haircut. Oh, that's Buddhist. Giant barbecue pork bun. Save these for later. I think we're gonna go out later today. I think we're gonna leave Saikong. It might be a bit of a shock to the system, but I think we need to do it.
Yeah. Today, Wednesday. Trip to Monkey Mountain? Are you crazy? No Monkey Mountain, man. Dude, monkeys scare the hell out of me. I had one walk right past me before, not far from here, on the road. I nearly shat myself, thought it was gonna attack me. It just totally ignored me and went about its business. But I was scared, man. Uh, we're in Saikung, a place called Saikung. Goodness me, goodness me. Did you guys see the leopard skin go past? Oh, you gotta, you gotta keep eye, maintain eye contact. That doesn't sound like a good idea. <laughs> oh, you pee on them. I don't know, I just saw, I just saw these two tan blonde ladies walk past and one had a leopard skirt on. Let's go. How do you... You can rewind the stream, or you have to go to the VOD. But they may, it may not have shown on camera. It's nothing, it's nothing. Nothing worth checking out. So I'm gonna just go to 7-Eleven, I th oh, actually. Uh, let me go to the shop here. So guys, I'm gonna just go to the shop, buy some drinks to take home, and then we're gonna head out in the car. What's the time? 10.30, sounds like, sounds good. Every, the time is okay. A lot of shit doesn't open until midday, but uh, I think the timing's gonna work out pretty good. I only got 500. Uh, paper. 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 Uh, paper
Um, I'm here, I'm here, I'm sorry. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Wow. <laughs> oh. Bye bye. Bye bye. Did you like that? Did you like that? We had a cat. We patted a cat. <laughs> it's okay, man. I'm, uh, I've been going to that shop for over 10 years. They know me pretty good and they don't mind me patting it. The, the lady, that old lady there that served me, she's always like, here, take the cat. She's like, here, take it, take it home. <laughs> Yeah, she always offers me, here, take it home. And I'm like, no, no, no. <laughs> That's... I want to ask little birthday cat, is that her favorite cat? Or is the ginger cat her favorite cat? I, I don't know, she, her head might explode trying it to decide. Lovely kitten mixed fruit cake. Minions cake. Oh, that looks like mango. Mango tart, nice. Oh, magical horse. It's not a unicorn though, it's only a magical horse. No egg yolks in there. None in there. She, uh, birthday cat might not have the volume on because she's at work. Yeah, mango's delicious, isn't it? I love mango. And mango tart, mmm. Guys, we're at the taxi stand. I'm gonna end the stream here, but we'll be coming back, uh, hopping in the car in a little while. I don't wanna say an exact time, but let's say within an hour I should be back. Oh god, nearly dropped my vape. Nearly disaster.
we're not we're not going to where the five guys is. We're not going to Hong Kong Island. Ooh. Everyone, thanks everyone. We'll be back. It was just a short stream this morning, but we'll be back in the car yeah, within an hour most likely. Thanks guys. Hope to see you around then. <laughs>